Take a moment, close your eyes, feel yourself sitting where you are. We're going to reach down, down through the floors, down through the basements, down deep through the earth, far below us, searching for the waters, the cool waters of chaos far below. Reach down and down until we hit the bedrock, move around until we find those pools. And once we find that pool of water, with each and every breath, we're going to bring that pool up and into our bodies. Bring them up into our feet and into our legs. Bring it up further into our loins, into our bellies. Each breath brings it further up into our chests and into our heads. And we keep on breathing in and pulling it up until it comes through the top of our heads and out of our hands and back into the earth filling us with these cool, crisp waters from far below, the waters of potential, the waters of chaos, filling us with all the energies from below. Take in these energies, enjoy these energies, fill yourself with these waters. And then we're going to reach up. We're going to reach up through the roof and up through the ceilings up through the sky through the clouds keep reaching up and up until we can find that one star directly above our heads our personal pole star we're going to reach up we're going to pull down the fires from above the fires of water bring this light down bring these fires down into us into our heads and into our chests with each and every breath we bring these fires down into our bellies and into our loins Next breath brings them down into our legs and into our feet until we have the waters coming up from below and the fires coming down from above, mingling, making yourself blow, filling you with the energies of order and chaos, fire and water. Take in all these energies, fill yourself with these energies. Use these energies to find your center and bring yourself to where you should be and with all the energies that you need to go through ritual tonight. Enjoy them, revel in them. And when you're ready, take the waters, push them down into the ground, take the fires, push them up into the sky, but keep within yourselves all the energies that you need. As you disconnect from the waters and disconnect from the fires, know that you can always reach down and reach up and pull these energies back into yourself whenever you need to. But for now, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And when you're ready, open your eyes prepare to do magic. Our first offerings are to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you surround us and support us. You aid us and you guide us. You give us food. You give us shelter. Without you, we would not be here. We would not be able to survive without all that you give us. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, accept our offerings. We are here to honor the gods. We're here to honor the ancestors. We're here to honor the land spirits. And we're here to ask blessings in return from all of the kindred. But first, let us hallow our hallows. Sacred well, your waters flow deep beneath the earth. Your waters connect us to the lands of the ancestors give you the silver to handle you, say sacred waters flow within us. The mighty fire, you burn and transform, you send our offerings high into the sky to the lands of the shining ones. We offer you this incense, we say sacred fires burn within us. The mighty tree, your roots reach deep into the earth, to the lands of the ancestors and wells far below. 
you know, branches run high into the sky to the lands of the shining ones far above. We connect you with the waters and we connect you with the fires. And we say, sacred tree, grow within us. And in my house, and in all of our houses, by the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. Next, we make offerings to the shining ones. Gods and goddesses of elder days, be you our patrons and matrons, those who we know of that look over us, we offer you welcome. Be you of this very earth where we all live, our own local deities, we offer you welcome. Be you unknowns to us, but yet those who watch over us, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Shining ones, accept our offers. As happens every now and then with good priests and good virtuous, we go out of order. So before we go any further, gatekeepers, To all of you who have aided us in the past, we call on you once more to aid us, to guide us, to watch over us. We call to you to take our messages far and wide. We call to you to bring back all that we need to hear. Gatekeepers all accept our offerings. Now, I ask that you join your magic with mine in my house and in all of our houses. Let our wells open. It's a gate to the underworld. The fires open. It's a gate to the upper world. The tree to the crossroad between all the worlds. Open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. And now, shining ones, I call to you in your proper space. Be you are matrons and patrons. Be you of this very earth. And be you unknown to us. To all of you, shining ones. Except for all of To the land spirits. You fur and feather, scale and skin. Leaf and twig, stem and flower. Be you unseen to us, our house spirits, and our land spirits, to go all of you. Come and join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. To the ancestors, be you of our family, those who we know have before. Be you are mentors and inspiration who have passed before us. Or be you of this very land where we each reside. To all the ancestors, come to our fire. Join us. Ancestors, accept our offerings. There are offerings to be made this time. Please feel free to make them. I make this offering and ask all those who need the help, all those who need the energy, that they receive what they need.
And now, mighty kindred, we give to you, we give to you one last time and we ask for blessings to return. Mighty kindred all, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, we ask, what blessings do we receive? Shining ones, shining ones, give us Uru's strength. Land spirits, land spirits, give us Kana's, the spark of inspiration. And the ancestors. The ancestors give us Tila's, the rune of right action in doing what needs to be done. For being given the strength and the inspiration to do it well, but we are given, being told that we need to do what we know needs to be done. We need to do the right thing. I think these omens are good as we are getting support from the kindred in our adventures. So, mighty kindred, in my waters, in all of our waters, fill our waters with the omens we have just heard, them with urus and the strength we need to do the right thing, them with kanas and the spark of inspiration to know what we need to do. And fill us with tilas to drive to do the right thing. Mighty kindred, fill these waters, fill them in my cups, fill them in all of our cups. Behold the waters of life. And now, let's thank all of those who have aided us. Mighty ancestors, be you our family, be you our chosen family, or be you of this very earth. You have aided us tonight as you've aided us and watched over us throughout the days and throughout the years. For all that you do for us ancestors, Ancestors, we thank you. My own spirits, be you the animal kin, be you the plant kin, or be you the unseen kin. To all of you, you have aided us tonight, as you have aided us throughout the days and throughout the years, for all that you have done for us. My own spirits, we thank you. And shining ones, be you our matrons and patrons, be you of this very earth, or be you unknown to us. For all that you've done for us tonight and all you do for us throughout the days and years. Shining ones, we thank you. And gatekeeper, I will not forget you this time. You have aided us once more. You have taken our offerings and messages far and wide. You have brought back all that we need to hear. For all that you do for us, gatekeepers, we thank you. And last but not least, Earth Mother, as you cover yourself with snow and ice and rain where I live, actually throughout most of the country, for all that you do, we honor you first. We recognize you first. And we thank you last. For it's with love and honor that we make offerings to you. Earth Mother, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace. For this rite has ended. <laughs>